Her nickname sounds like a tasty treat, but this Seattle police detective is one tough cookie whose life pur purpose has been to instill purpose in children. Now, her given name is Denise Bolden, but everybody, we mean Everybody in Seattle's Rainier Beach neighborhood knows her simply as Detective Cookie. And Kyra 7's Deborah Horn tells us that community is now creating a park devoted to the game of chess to honor her great work in the neighborhood, more often associated with violence as Western Washington gets real. Yes, Detective Cookie. Everywhere she goes in Rainier Beach, someone is calling her name, even during a television interview about her favorite topic. So the Detective Cookies Chess Park, we're going to have a king and queen overlooking everything. That topic, the game of chess. Because I have players for China. Where you at? <laughs> Who is that? We love you. I love you too. Okay. It is a measure of the impact Denise Bolden, Detective Cookie, it must be said, has had on this neighborhood and the children who live here, all through a game invented 1,500 years ago to teach strategy to military commanders. Since 2006, she has used chess under the aegis of the Seattle Police Department Community Outreach Program to teach Rainier Beach children just how much they are worth. It's a sport. Well, you don't have to be the fastest, the biggest, the tallest, the bravest, the strongest. You just sit down and you play. You don't even have to know the person's language. And I tell you, this chess club has brought many people together that would have never talked to each other, never said hi to each other, never played a, a game of chess with each other. Detective Cookie is an unlikely evangelist for the game of kings. For police officers, too, for that matter, she grew up in the projects in Chicago, witnessed there the sometimes dark side of law enforcement. As a black female, I have experienced some of this stuff growing up. I have been stopped for no reason. I've been in the car with my dad, and he has been pulled over for no reason. But then in high school, she met a cop. He was so wonderful, so nice and kind. He would buy kids food if they didn't have money. So at that point, that's when I decided I wanted to be a police officer. And I wanted to be a police officer just like him. In between, she danced on the TV show Soul Train, became a model, was even featured in the black fan favorite Jet Magazine. And then approximately right here, we're going to have a giant chess board. But her most enduring legacy will almost certainly be the park that will soon bear her name. But now we're going to have a permanent chess board. A park devoted solely to chess. And again, this is Detective Cookie's chess park, not Detective Cookie's playground and chess park. There wouldn't be no swings, no sliding boards. This is a chess park. If Detective Cookie's chess club began here at Rainier Beach Library, her career will likely end in this neighborhood as well, the place that has become her adopted home, a home on which she has made an indelible mark. Yes, be home next time. I have that report. I have earned it. Yes. Over 41 years on this Seattle Police Department. I've earned it. 41 years and counting. Reporting in Seattle, Deborah Horn, Cairo 7 News. What a role model, still changing lives. And you can find more of our Western Washington Gets Real stories on Cairo7.com. Just click on the Gets Real section at the top of our homepage.